Tonight, a local union is firing back following a proposed round of job cuts at Women and in Infants Hospital. As we first reported yesterday, Women and in Infants plans on laying off 41 workers and reducing the hours of six others to cut costs. Well, now the 1199 Service Employees International Union is accusing the hospital of putting profit above patient care. In a statement, the union says, quote, reducing the number of frontline health care workers could continue a drop in patient satisfaction at women and infants. The statement goes on to say, quote, the proposed layoffs are unnecessary given women and infants has enjoyed large operating surpluses over the last couple years. Women and infants claims it's receiving fewer patients and that revenues are down. Today, the Rhode Island Department of Labor and Training held an orientation to help affected workers learn about unemployment benefits and reemployment services offered by the state.